All right, now the last one is you can't separate escape right off. Um, sustained control is not an option. It's too escalated. You're going to have to incapacitate them. You're going to have to hurt them, inflict an injury. It's not what you want to do, but you want to be able to do it if you have to. So we're in our interview. He throws that punch. Boom, right into a point of reference to a point of control. Okay? Um, maybe I'm struggling in this position, whatever, and I feel like I need to um, injure them instead of taking them to the ground right away. The best way to do that is you have your shot here to the neck. You need to use your hand, the web of your hand. And you also have the ear. Um, I prefer the ear because you're going to throw them off balance. By hitting the third, you're going to cause pain, and you're going to cause them to you're going to distract them and to get them thinking about this pain in their ear. So from here, I got control over this arm. I'm canceling that other arm, I'm loading this leg. So I'm going to hit one. Now I'm going to let go of this arm as I step out. So hit again. This other hand is up. So it's going to come around the head, and then I'm going to push away as I run away. That's option one. Two, I get you here, I hit, boom. Maybe this is enough that now I can control him. So I hit, hit, and now I can control him. Down, 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 down. To here. I can do everything the same again like we demonstrated earlier or I can just separate and escape from this point. Okay?